of you today we will discuss our new chapter think around us and it is our lesson 8 in this chapter we will discuss about the different thing present in our nearby surrounding area now as you can look in the picture and identify them suppose it is man-made or natural first you can see the paste and paste is a man-made yes now the next one is a butterfly and butterfly is a natural because we can't make a butterfly because a butterfly is a living creature and next one is a chair now a chair is also a man-made now the last one in the corner you can see the heart and heart is also made by man now you can see the frog frog is a natural thing now next cake cake is also man-made because we create the cake because cake is a non-living now next is hand and hand is also a natural now next is a sweater and a sweater is a man-made thing now if we look around we will see different kind of thing nearby surrounding area now some of them are made by men while some are natural we will discuss about the natural and man-made thing in this topic first you can see the natural and man-made things like the things that are made by men are called man-made thing things like pen pencil book chair table shoes toys are all the man-made things and these things are not found in nature because we have created this now, suppose paper big tire ice cream this all are man-made thing now things that are not made by man but are found in the nature are called natural things suppose which we have not created by own like air water sky rock animal plant soil this all found in the nature and they are not made by man you can see butterfly stones fish tree this all are the natural things we have not created the man have not created this had been created by god yes these things have been created by god in this topic we have come to know about the man-made thing and the natural thing suppose the man-made thing i have told you that paper bake tire ice cream paint pencil book these are the different items which have been made by the man created by man invented by the man but there are something also present in the nature which have been not created by us it has been created by god suppose like butterfly stone fish tree cloud you can see the plants animals soil this all are the natural thing present in our earth surface and that's why we call them natural because it has been created itself not by us so we have come to know about these two difference because it's a very important to us to know about the difference between man-made thing and natural thing because uh, we also can invent and uh, make new things by own self then we came to know what we can do and what we can't not do that's why you try yourself what you can meet by yourself then you will better understand the example of uh, man-made and the natural thing